hello guys welcome back to the channel in this video we'll cover this pre-assessment skill badge so basically you have to just click on this and then come over here and click on start challenge and follow as i'm doing so that you get full score on this lab and entire skill batch basically here just by doing this challenge lab you get the entire batch now just click on start lab and just open the looker incognito window Now here we have to enter the credentials present on the lab instructions. We just enter like this. Just logged in. And the first thing is that many of you may face issue like you are unable to modify any file or create it. For that we have to enable the development port. So I am showing you how you have to do it. Do not worry about it. Just click on the development board toggle and you can see it will be enabled like this. Now from here we have to click on develop and quick labs e-commerce. Basically here we have to create the view files and then update the quick labs e-commerce file so just come over here and here you can see in the description box i've shared this repository so just copy the name carefully make sure there is an INA full stop now click on create view paste it and after that you have to remove entire content of the file okay make sure the file is open correctly come over here select it paste over here like this and, and once just you have save the click changes. on save changes again we have to create another view so for that click on these three dots create view and for the name come over here just copy the user details paste over here and again replace entire content make sure the file is correctly opened over here replace it paste it and just save it once you have saved it you have to update the model file also so just come over here and just replace entire content come bottom just select it just paste over here now here basically we have to update two filters value one and value two come to the task number one from here just scroll down and here you can see wait a second yes filter one is 138 it might be different for you so copy accordingly and just update the value one filter like this value one filter update it similarly you have to update the value two also come down over here in the filter three it is mentioned so you have to just copy it like this it might be different so always check the lab instruction for the values all these things are updated cross verify if there is any value missing or the lab is showing to update any other value like so once you see like this you have to just save it and then validate look email and commit let me show you how you have to do just click on the save changes then after that you have to just cross verify once again all things are correctly if you get any kind of error like sometimes what happens files does not get saved automatically then you have to just check the file contents and update it now just click on the validate option and once you have clicked on validate it will take some time then you have to just click on commit option so just click on the commit option and there you have to type any message you can type any message and if you are new to this channel do like the video and subscribe the channel for other pre-assessment skill badges and lab free courses you can check the description box in the master sheet also you can check the playlist also now just type any message and just deploy to production now once you have run deploy to production you have to come back to the lab instruction and check the score for all the tasks but you won't get 100 out of 100 for last task we have to do one more thing so here till basically you'll get 80 out of 100 so just check it you can navigate to each task and check the score or you can just refresh the browser window so here we got 80 out of 100 now for the last task come over here we have to do it the model file and update the number of hours so come back here make sure it is open running underscore e-commerce replace entire content and from here you can update the hours okay so for the hours come over here last task and just copy it carefully paste it like this make sure it is correctly saved okay now just save it validate look ml and then commit again and deploy now basically here you won't get the score instantly you have to wait for at least four to five minutes after com completing this task then only you'll get the score there is no error you will get if you have got 80 out of 100 and if you have followed the way i have done you need to wait for four to five minutes more and then you'll get the score in this particular task so if you try to check the score you won't get the score instantly so i am recommending wait for at least five to ten minutes and then you'll be able to get the score and then i will show you how you have to claim the batch
and if you are getting any kind of error in the looker itself then you have to just remodify the file and just deploy it okay so here you can see we did not get any error so basically we have to wait only so just wait for some more time and then you will be able to complete the lab just wait and watch meanwhile for other pre-assessment skill badges and lab free courses you can check the description now here all things are already completed so we have to just wait only so just wait for some more time think you have make any mistake come over here and again replace the content and cross verify the hours from the lab instruction just update it and then save changes and then you have to just check it basically there was no mistake that's why you can see here that we don't have to deploy it again just wait and just check the score you can see we have got the score that means we are done with the lab it take me at it took me at least five to seven minutes so it depending on you you can check it now just in the lab you can see it is showing complete that means we have on the skill batch that's how we completed the lab do like the video and subscribe the channel.